Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Guess what happened to the liberal guy who burned flag online on 4th of July? A liberal social justice warrior in Illinois celebrated the 4th of July online by burning the American flag and posting it for all to see how cool he thought he was. Bryden Mellet, 22, probably felt brave and powerful sharing his anti-American treasonous rant as he degraded the country that real heroes have died fighting for. However, the chump had no clue what was coming and got exactly what he deserved when karma caught up with him and was not kind. According to BizPack Review, Mellet's post read, I am not proud to be an American. In this moment, being proud of my country is to ignore the atrocities committed against people of color, people living in poverty, people who identify as women, and against my own queer community on a daily basis. I would like to one day feel a sense of pride toward my nationality again. But too little progress has been made. Too many people still suffer at the hands of politicians influenced by special interests. Too many people are still being killed and brutalized by a police force plagued with authority complexes and racism. Too many people are allowed to be slaughtered for the sake of GN manufacturer profits. Too many Americans hold hate in their hearts in the name of their religion and for fear of others. And that's only to speak of domestic issues. I do not have pride in my country. I am overwhelmingly ashamed, and I will demonstrate my feelings accordingly. Hashtag arrest me. Many any calls were sent to the Urbana Police Department after this little stunt. The post appeared on a Sunday prior to Independence Day 2016. People were concerned about Mellet's disturbing message and were convinced he might do something to others. This reaction was probably what Mellet had hoped for considering he's probably never been feared in his life. However, after getting what he asked for and what he deserved from law enforcement, Mellet decided to get revenge. Mellet's place of employment, Walmart also received an increasing amount of threats and angry calls about the post. So the police decided to talk with Mellitz and his employer. The police noted to Mellet that they understood his right to free speech. The real concern was the danger he created for himself and others as a result of his actions. However, the young delinquent didn't care much for the officer's advice and continued his ridiculous and criminal behavior. He was eventually arrested for flag desecration under Illinois statute, which is a felony in the state. He was also charged with disorderly conduct and released on his own recognizance. The police noted, recognizes that this is a case where the right of free speech comes into conflict with the safety of uninvolved citizens. The actions taken in this case have been to try to assure the safety of the public and Mr. Mallet. The Urbana police urge the public to express themselves in a peaceful way and to not retaliate against unpopular speech. Apparently, some people have no shame and to do such a thing the day before the 4th of July is especially disrespectful to the country he calls home, protected by heroes who have sacrificed for him. However, that didn't stop him from further retaliation. According to the Washington Times, Mellet didn't think it was fair that he was arrested and sued. An Illinois man arrested last summer after burning an American flag and posting proof on Facebook filed a federal civil rights lawsuit Wednesday challenging the constitutionality of the state's desecration statute. Attorneys for the American Civil Liberties Union filed the suit in Urbana Federal Court this week on behalf of Bryden Mellet, 22, in an effort to ensure others don't end up behind bars for similarly exercising their First Amendment rights. Mr. Mellet spent five hours in the Champaign County Jail on July 4 after authorities charged him with violating the state's flag desecration law. Prosecutors ultimately decided to drop their case the following day but the ACLU wants a federal judge to make it clear that authorities can't arrest anyone else for following in the flag burner's footsteps. It's very clear that this law is unconstitutional and we want to make sure that in the future, Illinois law enforcement officers know that they cannot arrest people under this statute, ACLU attorney Rebecca Glenberg said at a press conference Thursday announcing the lawsuit. The 11-page complaint filed in U.S. District Court for the Central District of Illinois claims that Mr. Mellet's decision to burn an American flag and post pictures online are both examples of protected speech, therefore placing the state's desecration statute in violation of the U.S. Constitution. The irony of Mellet's actions is probably lost on him. He can burn the flag because he lives in this great country that protects the freedom to disrespect it. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.